All right, guys. I did the Genesis. You guys said I have to do Wicked Ways. You guys never steer me wrong. I've got a bunch of Ren reactions up. Um, you know, I, I read most of the comments. I try to read all of them. If I like and I heart, that means I've read it. Um, it's hard for me to respond because there's so many coming in now. Thank you guys for that. People say it's a good problem to have. It's like, well, no, I, I want people... If someone's going to take the time to watch my video and then take the time to comment or and subscribe, I want them to understand that I, that's appreciated. So this is my way of doing that. But look, we're here for Wicked Ways. Ren, let's get into it. Wicked Ways. He's, do he's doing an auto-tune thing, guys. Did you guys steer me wrong? Let's find out. I am the eye of the storm. I am the poisonous one. I am the grip of the gun. I am the zip of the body bag zip in the shot when it's done. I am the hit and the run. I am the prodigal son. I am a tail of the hun. Rhythm spectacular cardiovascular rhyming on beast when I run. I am the mm. G. I am the genie of flow. Brands of genie is dreaming and scheming like glow. I am a man with the flow. Hit when your stamina is low. Oh, so cold. My vocal is post to top shelf. I'm local, not social. Chewing toads to by myself. Ay. I am the bite of the beast. I am the night of the feast. I will be fighting the peace. Hit like Muhammad Ali, cause I come with the dangerous reach I am the wolf of the sheep, light on my feet when I creep uh, I am the cousin of sleep, sleep is the cousin of death So I guess I'm the grimmest I breathe I am the nun Wow Wow, it's, you, you know, when people try So if you have an artist who does, let's say, I don't know, indie or alternative or whatever And they, they try to do rap nine times out of, well, most of the time I'm really not that impressed Ren, complete opposite um time and time again i mean he has some i did a reaction to like losing it and a few different songs and he's got the fun element some of it he's just kind of playing around and doing the like uh look at what i can do with these words um and then he, he also has songs like this and um i did seven sins as well where it's um it's like yeah this, this guy is is talented at rapping um and, and he's i can tell he spent a lot of time writing as well um, because in order to do what he's doing here, you have to spend hours and hours and hours and hours and hours of writing lyrics. Constant modification. When you write four, three, five, twenty lines, um, you go over it again. And you say, you know what? That doesn't really flow there. I'm going to switch that or I'm going to remove this syllable and replace it with this because um, it sounds better. Or because then I can hit the, the three rhyming syllables at the end of the line as opposed to two. Um, I mean, in order to do what he's doing here, it is incredibly, um, you know, I, I've spent a little time writing and so I can recognize and definitely respect when someone, someone comes with, um, yeah, I, I mean, well-written lyrics and the ability to, to rap them and make it sound good over, over a beat. Let's go. When toads too, by myself, ay. I am the bite of the beast. I am the night of the feast. I will be fighting the peace. Hit like Muhammad Ali, cause I come with the dangerous reach. I am the wolf of the sheep. Light on my feet when I creep. Yeah, if you guys don't know Muhammad Ali, you know, his, his, um, if you guys don't get the boxing thing, it's, it's worth checking out. Muhammad Ali, cause I come with the dangerous reach. I am the wolf of the sheep. Light on my feet when I creep. Uh. I am the cousin of sleep. sleep. And so another thing I'm going to comment on, um, I, you guys have heard this song probably a million times. You're here for a reaction. I do analysis and breakdown. If you don't like that, then probably you should go to a different channel right now because I'm just going to keep doing it. Um, he's he's so far, he's he's laying out kind of all of these um, wicked ways, these evil things. Um, these, you know, I'm, I'm fighting the peace. I'm... Uh, I mean, I mean, shoot, he said a thousand different things um, that are all kind of on the theme of like, these are these are evil things. Um, these these are, are put simply uh, bad things. And so I'm, I'm curious where it's going to go from here. If it's the cousin of that, so I guess I'm the grimmest I breathe. I am the nemesis, enter the dragon, put emphasis on the creation of time. So they call me the genesis, venomous, I need the therapist, sit and recline in the mind of the specialist. Put, put emph emphasis on the generation of rhyme, so they call me the genesis? Wow, is that what he said? Wow. People tell me to keep the lyrics up and read them. It's like, no, that's not my that's not my thing. If I, I I'd like to analyze the words that I'm hearing. Personally, I don't like the lyrics on the screen, but let, let's keep going, guys. Phenomenal. From the creation of time, so they call me the genesis. Venom is mine. Need a therapist. Sit and recline in the mind of the specialist. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Quiet when I walk. Bit the 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 bit the
Oh sweet Jesus, oh my my, what will fill my appetite? What will feed this hunger in my stomach growing every night? Oh my goodness, oh my days, I'm stuck in my wicked ways. Sometimes I fall off the path of righteousness, but that's okay. Oh sweet Jesus, oh my my, Lord I need a other fight. Lord I need redemption from the tension growing in my mind. Oh my mm. goodness, oh my days, I'm caught in my wicked ways. So he's doing a flow here um, that is, is commonly replicated in American, I don't know about other hip-hop uh i haven't seen it too much in in the uk but primarily american hip-hop there's a like that uh that flow if you can even call it a flow i mean it, it just seems like a, a very i have no respect for it i mean migos made it famous uh migos were the were the ones that really did that and then everyone not everyone a lot of people started copying migos from then on out and so it's interesting that he has a song about wicked ways and um you know all these all these different essentially talking about the embodiment of evil and then he's doing this flow that is um signature to in my opinion garbage trash terrible music that i don't even think is art or even close to art Let's keep going, guys. For those of you who... Sometimes I fall off the path of righteousness, but that's okay. Oh, sweet Jesus, oh my, my, Lord, I need a other fight. Lord, I need redemption from the tension growing in my mind. Oh, my goodness, oh, my days. I'm caught in my wicked ways. Sometimes I fall off the path of righteousness, but that's okay. I am the blood run red. I am the day of the dead. I am the hole in your head. Pull it, pull it, lead. Fuck up the whole damn program, I'm Hulk Hogan, Wolverine, Logan, Trojan, horse with the force of a four-door hummer, motherfucker, uncle. I am, I am the force of a, of a, a oh my, I, I gotta go back, guys. I am the hole in your head, pull it, pull it, lad. I, I am the force of a four-door hummer that, yeah. Fuck up the whole damn program, I'm Hulk Hogan, Wolverine, Logan, Trojan, horse with the force of a four-door hummer, motherfucker, uncle. I am the cream of the crop, I'm the behemoth of the pop. I will be stopping the clocks. I am the one that makes you bow down when you're down there. Suck my uh, reload, mm. pop, pop, pop. No shame, point at pop. Make him drop. Main mode, pull up, stop. Drop the body off. Uh. Mother Mary, me, oh my. Think I feel a fright inside. Dealing mm. with my demons. I've been kneeling. Break the with the sky. Oh my goodness, oh my gosh. Leave me strung out on the cross. Let the crows feast on my bows. I lose control when they'll be dropped. Liar, liar, pants on fire. I pray to a false messiah. So protest conflicted in a convoluted magnet. Oh my goodness, oh my days, I'm caught in my wicked ways. Sometimes I fall off the path of right. Boy, like a motherfucker, kid with precision, go to war. Like I'm down the glove, I hit him, I'll be spinning in the jaw. Like an undercover villain, I go with him when I talk. Kill him when I talk. Kill him when I pop off and drop off the top of the take off. I pull up and pull up and pile up the payout. I pick up the liquor, then stick off the checkout. I'm quick on the trigger. Click, click, pow, pow. Quick, quick, no doubt, lip, rip, more class. Six, 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 so I'll come with the fire, the burn, and empire return the bar while you're done. Ren could give Tech Nine a run for his money. I don't know if you guys know who Tech Nine is. He's an Amer uh, American rapper. He's he does a similar style to what Ren just switched up to. Um, yeah, Ren could give Tech Nine a run for his money for sure. I mean, Tech Nine Tech Nine's a beast. He's he's got a lot of discography. He's he's a he's a master of his craft, um, in my opinion. But uh, yeah, Ren could Ren could give him a run for. I'd like to see them do a collaboration. Ren, when you're done in Canada, my brother, come down to the U.S., go to Oklahoma City, hook up with Tech 9 man, do a collaboration, I'd love to see it, and if you're talking about Wicked Ways, one of his big things is horrorcore, so let's, let's keep going. Take it higher, I'ma kill it like I always kill it, body back, zip it, I'ma feel it like I always feel it, keep it so prolific. Oh my goodness, oh my days, I'm stuck in my wicked ways. Sometimes I fall off the path of he, he, so he's purposefully making it so he's purposefully making it so the notes don't really match. I love this. I love this. So I don't know if this is a broader commentary on um the wicked ways of society or if he's kind of poking fun at the commercial rap in the US. Either way, uh brilliant song. Righteousness, but that's okay. Yeah, so he started with the auto tune and he ended with the auto tune. So I'm, I'm suspecting this is a shot at commercial rap. 
She. Who does that? Drake. Drake. The man who is, who his, Aubrey Graham is his name. Aubrey Graham is completely disconnected from Drake and his music. That like the there's no genuineness like there's no there's no there's a complete disconnect between him and the music, um I I wow, yeah Ren, dude talk talk that stuff about these these U S commercial artists because not enough people do, um I'm one of the people where I'll I'll do reactions and at the end of it I did one the other day for, to a, a Dave song, uh it's called Professor X and at the end of it I can't even post it because it because of copyright, um but I was like yeah. Dave's all right, I guess. Like, you know, this wasn't really this wasn't really all that. Like, it's kind of a commercial. Half the song he sp he spent talking about, um, you know, all the you you guys say birds over there in the UK, but um, you know, all the all the women he gets and all that. It's like, dude, you, you're not impressing me. Um, anyway, guys, um, yeah, what a phenomenal track. I like this, and um, I I like that he started with the auto tune. And he ends with the auto tune, so that leads me to believe this is a shot at commercial rap. I, that's my interpretation. Now, art is incredible. The point of art is that seven hundred people can draw seven hundred different conclusions from the same art. Um, that's what really great art does. So, and to his point, if you listen to a commercial rap song, it's like there's no interpretation to be done. There's no open endedness. There's no thought. There's no soul. Where's the soul in that? I, I'm going to call it shit. Where's the soul in that shit? It does not exist. Um, because there is none. You know, there's, it's, I don't, I don't like that kind of stuff. And so I, I like that Ren uh, kind of took, took a little, uh, I haven't really heard him. I mean, he's, he's made blanket like lines about, you know, like, oh, people can't contend with me, this and that. I mean, every rapper does that, but to, to make a song where, um, you know, I said it could be a broader um, kind of commentary on on society, and and um, I I do you know I'm not anti-capitalist, but I do think um, you know uh, unregulated capitalism taken to its extreme when you have billion-dollar companies that could not give a flying fuck about you, your family, or your community. Then, then it becomes a problem, and then you you do get wicked ways spreading. Um, so I, I'm not anti, I'm not like, you know, I don't think communism or socialism. I'm not here to like get political, but I don't this, I don't take it to any extreme. You know, I think any ideology to the extreme is where you screw up. It doesn't matter what the ideology is, but it's the extremes that you start getting dangerous in. So I I'm of the opinion that in the '90s rap was probably at its best it people a lot of people call it the golden age of hip-hop i'm of the opinion that that's that's probably true and right around i mean there was commercial aspects to it but there was still a lot of integrity and then around early 2000s late 90s you started to all also around the time tupac biggie and a, a lot of really, really good hip hop artists were getting shot at clubs, were getting shot in Las Vegas, shot wherever, whenever, and no one could ever find the killers. I'm not going conspiracy mode, but um, yeah, so it, it started to take a turn right around there. Um, 50 Cent came out, and from there, not, I'm not, I'm not dissing 50 Cent, guys. I'm not saying he screwed the game up, um, but commercialism got involved in hip hop, and then ten years later, you started having n people come out with with no little to no lyrical integrity, little to no artistry. I mean, commercial beats with commercial raps, and it sold. And so from here on out, you know, that's how you have people like Lil Pump. That's how you have you know people like like uh, what's that Takashi Six Nine or whatever. Um, that's how you have a lot of these just people who are clowns, um, who, who aren't artists are like, I, I'm not saying they're not music artists. I'm saying they're not artists. They're not artistic is, is what I mean by that. Um, yeah, well, I could go on for a while about this guys, but, uh, I definitely think the, the commercial aspect that started to really come into hip hop, just like with every, you can say the same thing about rock. I've heard people say the same thing about rock um, in different genres where once it started getting too commercial, country, for instance, 
there are people that hate Florida Georgia Line um, because they view it as, um, you know, super commercial country. Like, like that's not what country is about. You know, country is about anti, you know, taking part in the system. And that's how I feel about hip hop. And a lot of people feel that way about rock. And so for me, it's not it's not simply I don't think. I think it's too potentially too simplistic to just say, oh, capitalism ruins everything. It's like, well, okay, but like greed, it points to money game part one, two, and three, and a lot of what Ren talks about. Greed um, and, and uh, putting money over humans, that's the core of it for me. Um, and when you get people with a board who invest in a company, the only thing they care about is that the money they invested increases. And they're not concerned with, oh, how do our employees feel? How do this, how that? Maybe there are some board members who do. Okay, I don't know many board members of Fortune 500 companies, but I'm ranting on a little bit here, guys. Um, Ren tends to do this to me. Um, but yeah, definitely, definitely an interesting concept uh, to say the least. If you guys like the video and like the reaction, feel free to like, subscribe, comment. And if you didn't like the pausing or the talking, I already said the F word, you can get the fuck off my channel. Okay? I, I'm not here. If you want someone to do just a simple physical reaction, ooh, oh, sick, oh, it's, oh, he's spitting straight facts, but they don't even know what the facts are. They don't even know what the guy said. They're just doing a react. I've seen them, guys. I've seen these reactors. It's like, wow. Um, I, I, I probably annoy people when I'm like, oh, I didn't catch that, or like, oh, I have to rewind it for the Hummer bar, the power of a four-door Hummer, um, <laughs> or, uh, yeah, um, even that I just butchered it, you know. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna BS. I don't have the lyrics sitting right here, and I'm glancing over. Oh, the lyrics! No, this is this is genuine. This is real shit on this channel. So I appreciate a lot of the comments that you guys have made. Um, basically saying what I just said is like, look, if they want a simple reaction, they can find that on YouTube. If they want a brainless reaction, they can find that on YouTube. If they want to hear the original content, they can go to the original content. You know, I'm, I'm leaning more towards commentary on this channel. Um, sometimes I'll do reactions where it's like, I, I, I just enjoy it. Um, I just did a, the big push, their busking thing. And I, I'm just like, yeah, I'm just, I'm vibing with this. I like it. And I said a few things in it, but you know, it's like, uh, there isn't like uh, that much to analyze in it. You know, no disrespect to it at all. It's just, it's a different kind of um, piece of, piece of work. And so I respond to what's in front of me. And if there's something like this, you got to you got to talk about these things, guys. Anyway, you guys take care out there. I'm going to wrap this one up.